to educate our future leaders of tomorrow. And these students are bright, they're eager, they're driven. Dreamers are still dreaming. New York State refused to pass a bill to give college-age undocumented immigrants financial aid for higher education. At rallies and forums, they worked hard to convince legislators and the governor to support the plan. They're the ones who are going to drive our city and state's economy up to prosperity. They're the ones who are going to go out and create more jobs. They're the ones who are going to innovate, be entrepreneurs, who are going to be the doctors, who can save maybe your loved ones' lives if you just give them a chance. But a recent Siena College poll shows that 56% of New Yorkers oppose the New York State Dream Act for financial aid. Jim belongs to an anti-immigrant group. This group seems to think that democracy means Cuomo caving to their demands when the majority of people who are here legally and vote and pay taxes clearly do not want the New York Dream Act. Governor Cuomo was up for re-election this fall. He opposed the act and refused to put money for it in the state budget. It's not a handout, but the New York Dream Act is an investment in our future. It's not only an investment on our future, our future. It's an investment for the future of New York as well. While it's over for this year, dreamers still hope change will come to New York State. They plan on continuing to try and convince legislators and the public that financial aid for them is a good investment for all. Saida Frias, ConsumerMojo.com.